federal officials are once again urging Americans to get vaccinated against COVID-19. The CDC saying infections are once again on the rise. Caroline Shively has more. The White House plans to renew its calls next month for Americans to get their COVID booster shots this fall. It comes as the CDC reports a spike in infections driven by the ARIS subvariant. It's summer. Um, people might be spending more time inside, especially with all these heat waves we've been having. According to the agency, more than 10,000 people were hospitalized with the virus during the week ending August 5th. That's a 14 percent increase from the week prior, but an improvement from this time last year when more than 41,000 people were hospitalized. Still, health experts warn those numbers could rise. Partly because of the waning vaccine immunity and also the increase in travel, and also the new variants that are circulating right now. Moderna and Pfizer expect the FDA to authorize their updated boosters by the end of the month. Then it's up to the CDC to approve the formula. A Biden administration official tells Fox Business on Monday it expects the shots to become available in September. Quote, we know that vaccination against COVID-19 remains the safest protection for avoiding hospitalizations, long-term health outcomes and death. Federal officials say they're working to make the vaccines accessible. The administration has a program where people are going to be able to get these for free at pharmacies. That program should be up and running by the time these vaccines become available. In addition to COVID boosters, public health officials are urging Americans to get their flu and RSV shots this fall. In Washington, Caroline Shively, Fox News.